let me just say this one story. I'm in Phoenix. I'm working out in Phoenix, Arizona. I'm working out. And it's Ramadan. And I'm not working out, but I'm just doing an interview. And I'm doing an interview with this guy. And I'm talking a little scared. He got very little hands. You know those little white guys with small little hands? And he's nice. And some guys were picking on him. And I said, yo, chill out. Leave him alone. You know, I got my Ramadan stuff on. I think I'm religious. So I come over. I'm talking to him and stuff. He's very tiny, petite little guy. Thank you. And thank you, sir. And then he leaves. I do the interview. Two or three days come by. SWAT has the whole gym surrounding yeah. I'm like, wow. And because like, I went out the night before and I'm saying to myself, who else did I grab? <laughs> Shit, why is Squat here? <laughs> and then I said, but then I said, hey, if um if I grabbed my ass, it wouldn't be the feds here, right? So I'm saying, what the hell did I do? So they come in and they show a picture of me and this guy shaking hands. And I'm saying, fuck. This guy's probably to have a lawsuit. I must have did something that got this guy nervous or something. And he said, Do you know this guy? And I said, Well, listen. I was promoting a fight, and I must have got a little animated, and he may have gotten scared. If anything happened, I'm just sorry. I didn't mean to. And then he snatched the paper back. The picture back. No, Mr. Tyson, he liked you. He didn't like the 20 people he shot and the eight that he killed. Ooh. What? Wow. He was the baseline shooter. He was a serial killer. He was the, he was the boxing writer, too. The skinny little white yeah, look, guy look, that you were... Mike Tyson and serial killer. Check that out. No, really. The skinny little white guy you were describing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mike Tyson... David Hausner? Yeah, Hausner, yeah. Check him out. That little fucker, right? Look at his hands. <laughs> look at it. No, I'm serious, man. Y'all laughing. Look at his hands. He's a little small. Look, he looks like. Yeah. He was, and, and the interview so, oh, Mr. Tyson. Oh, my God. I'm such a fan. Uh, I'm like, fuck it. I'm like, look, it's okay, brother. Don't worry. Nobody's going to fuck with you. Because you know, they were f- fucking with him outside. You know what I mean? I said, don't worry about it. I got you. And I thought something happened, you know. I'm f- and he turned out to be a mass murderer? Yeah. He, he, he shot. T- 28 or something, eight, eight, but he killed eight. Rob, scroll down and see the story. Find out how many people he killed. He killed eight, but I know he shot around 20 of them. Dirty motherfucker. And he, got, he committed suicide in prison, so I guess that turned out great. He committed suicide in prison. Yeah. So, so you met, again, you met a lot of uh, uh, weird cats. Listen. Uh, Would this guy be at the top? 29 people he shot, eight he murdered. What? Yeah. Listen. Listen, this Nine. is my life. Listen, I must draw these kind of people because I'm I'm in Australia, right? And I'm taking pictures with people, right? And one side of me, after they get the picture, I got the Aryan guy right here, with the big beard, and then I got the Taliban guy right here. And it was a lo- and that's what it was. Mike Tyson was a local Australian Taliban supporter, and I got the, the Aryan bike rider on my right, on my left. <laughs> And I say to my people, hey, man, how do those people get close to me like that? You know what they said? They bought a ticket. Mm-hmm. They bought a ticket. That's that what you it. said. That's what they that's said. What they, yeah. That's what they said. They bought Got a it. ticket. Access. So if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.